What if you woke up one day and your best friend was gone? What if you knew you could never see them again? What if you knew you could never see their smile, hear their laugh, embrace their presence? What if you knew you could have prevented it? My best friend smoked his first cigarette at 10 and took his last breath at 17. He was a good guy, smart, nice, funny, captain of the football team. Definitely not someone you expect to see with a cigarette in their hand. But he took it all for granted. Life, cigarettes, he didn't think anything could ever harm him. He was unstoppable. He had the whole world at his fingertips. Until one day, the unstoppable was stopped. We see kids smoking. In the movies we watch, the video games we play, the websites we visit, and even among the people we surround ourselves with. We just want to fit in. So we imitate their behavior, not knowing that someone else might be trying to imitate us for those very same reasons. Because of addiction, about three out of four teen smokers will smoke into adulthood, even if they intend to quit after a few years. Every day in the United States, 1,200 people die due to smoking. And for each of those deaths, two young adults become regular smokers each day. Nearly nine out of 10 smokers start smoking by age 18. Smoking reduces lung function and retards lung growth. And teens are more sensitive to nicotine and can feel more dependent earlier on than most adults. Right here, right now. Be the end to the cycle.